Welcome back, everyone. It's 921. We all know the importance of eating fruits and vegetables, but it might be a challenge to convince your family of that. What about you, Ryan? You yeah, and your dad eat a lot of greens? Nah, we do a lot of burgers <laughs> and whatnot. But today, it's going to be tasty and it's going to be healthy. We're making smoothies here in the Bender Kitchen, uh, and we are with April Godfrey, and she is a holistic health and wellness coach and creator of SweetSimpleDelicious.com. And also, we were just talking, you lived in Bermuda for 12 years. Why are you in Connecticut? As, as much as we love CP. <laughs> I came home. I came okay. home. You do that. Home. Yeah, you do. You find your way home. And I have small children now, and Bermuda's amazing, and they're mm -hmm. from there, and it was incredible. But it was time to come home and be around family, and... It's always helpful to have family yeah. around with the little sure. ones, yes. right? Absolutely. So, so are these sort of uh, Bermuda-inspired, or are they just... <laughs> these, no, food? these are health and wellness worldwide-inspired. Um, although, what you were saying about getting people to eat your greens, mm -hmm. this is a great way to... Sneak. Sneak them all in. I mean, it's pretty green, which sometimes kids like that it's green. Yeah. Um, but with enough fruit in there, it balances out, so they're getting all of th this goodness um, and just drinking it up all in one go to start the day. How much uh, should we be eating on a daily basis between the fruits and veggies? Is there like a recommended? Great question. We should be having 8 to 13 servings of fruits and vegetables oh, wow. a day. So how many we people gotta, do you know that get run. those yeah, nobody. in? I feel right? like our friend Megan Yost probably gets yes. that in, right? <laughs> yeah, she's, the, she's always eating fruits, veggies, all the gluten-free, dairy. Yeah, yeah. yeah she's good at that, but not, not everybody. But this will help. Yeah, getting all these plants in. So this is a smoothie that is geared towards good digestion okay. and boosting your immune system. A huge um, portion of our immune system is in our gut. So it's really important to keep that microbiome healthy and functioning and everything flowing. Like probiotics? Yes, those probiotics are, big, right? are really big. Which big words in the show. Too, I add so. those into smoothies. You can add them into your smoothie and then you're just getting them. Terrific. Um, so I've got spinach here that's got vitamin A and phytonutrients. Parsley is incredible for boosting your digestion and getting rid of bloat. We've got uh, coconut water, which again, boosts your immune system, filled with electrolytes. Coconut water is like nature's sport drink. Forget all the crazy sports drinks. Uh -huh. Get Go some coconut, coconut water. water. Yeah, okay. regular water first, always, have, just proper water. Have you tried that, Teresa, the coconut water? Have you ever? Yeah, I mean, it might be different in a smoothie, True. right? Yeah. Well, give it another shot. <laughs> yes. So great way to add electrolytes. And then we've got some um, citrus, some lemon, which is fantastic for your digestive system okay. and helping your kidney functions. Um, and some banana, which is nice and sweet mm -hmm. um, and a low glycemic index. So you're going to have a slow release of the sugars um, into time. your system. Yeah, and mango, vitamin A again, great for like your you digestive. Oh, do you know right. that's Bermuda that for 12 really? years? Yes. Yeah, wow. that's like, it's literally a vitamin, you know? I like that, I like exactly. that. So, so what's the process? We, we put it in the blender. So put it in the blender. Everything. So I've got some spinach here already. I've already put those in. I'm going to pull these in. This is going to have a sweet taste with it's the mango sweet, and the It's going to be sweet, you know, banana. and even with the parsley. So parsley, you might want to go in a little more timidly at first okay. and then add more. Our cilantro is great. All of those herbs, you can just add in. Um, I already put some lemon and lime in there. And yeah, you can pour that out. So this is the finished product. That is the finished. Though, goes into yeah, making these a little smoothies, prep. Right? Although I will say, if you're prepared, you know, if you wash your fruits and vegetables ahead of time, you um, oh, are not gonna. It's not so bad. You know what? You could even do what I've done before. If I know I have a crazy week though. coming up, oh, sure. <laughs> I'll put all of the ingredients into a freezer bag. Oh, good idea. Without the liquid, and then dump. and then put it in the freezer. <laughs> so I've got bags. I can pull out a bag, put it in the blender, add whatever liquid, whether it's coconut water. Almond milk. That's good. Do you like it? It's good, right? Oh, you dig fantastic. it, right? That, you, Cheers. Wow, I typically don't like anything all that healthy. This this is do your kids like it also? Do they you make do. They your... do. My son mostly. My daughter's a little. My daughter's older, so mm -hmm. she's kind of like, "Mommy, I'm onto she's you." She's picky. Right? I know. Yeah. She, she gets yes. it. All right. April, thank you so much for, for, for joining us. We got to scoot, unfortunately. Where, where can we check you out online? Sweet Delicious. SweetSimpleDelicious.com. Very right, good. Awesome. Have a great weekend, everybody.